This video is brought to you by Smugglers Run Gaming, growing and organizing competitive gaming communities. Check them out at facebook.com at Smugglers Run Gaming. Hello everyone, welcome back to Dice Commando. This is round three tonight from Monday Night Dice, the final standard tournament of the Way of the Force meta. On our left we have Andrew, he's playing Kylo Price. On our right we have Mike, who we saw in the last round. He's playing Afra, Elite Sienna, Rebel Trader. Roll in looks like it was a tie. And Andrew should get that one. Certainly choose his battlefield. Mike is on the docking bay, but Andrew will want to use the throne room. So Mike puts the shields on one on Sienna and one on Afra. Nope, one on the trader. And let's get started. Andrew opens with the binds. It's a good start. Mike opens with Sienna. Ooh, strong roll. Last game he opened with double money, so that's that's what you get. All right, Andrew has a significantly stronger roll with his price special and a price two. Now, just to be clear, the docking bay has not been flipped over, but we are playing on the throne room. Oop, Mike needs some card draw help, so he crash lands, takes the two, takes him on the shields. It does let him draw a card. Andrew binds for an ancient on Kylo. All right, there's triple zero for one with Afra. The indirect ping damage is on. All right, Kylo comes in. Andrew probably calls yellow. Drew yellow. Yep, called yellow. Two into Sienna. Generally, the priced decks are predominantly yellow, so it makes sense to call that. All right, Mike thinking over his next action here. So when Kylo came in, he did roll a two melee, a disrupt, and a shield. So defensive maneuver to remove two from Sienna, put one on Afra and the traitor, deal one indirect, and Mike gets to draw a card. I don't think we've seen him draw yet. There he draws. Okay, Andrew pitches to reroll, gets a two for one and a shield. He dropped new orders, which he doesn't need anymore, of course. Mike rolls in triple zero, gets a one melee. And Andrew plays close quarters assault. He'll get to drop three cards from Mike. He gets a reprogram, a relentless pursuit, and a backup muscle. Oh, there was only two. Yeah, so yeah, I, Andrew in his head, and me as well doing the announcing, I had the, uh, the price to... All right, so Andrew... Resolves the price special for three into Sienna. Remember the price special is if you control the battlefield, you can not only flip, but you can then immediately resolve for plus one. Two more into Sienna from Kylo. Afra came in on a blank in the meantime. Mike's certainly going to pitch to reroll here. Right, all three blanks he picks up. Does he pick up the trader as well? Oh man, it picks up triple zero as well. All right, Sienna on a blank, on a plus two. We did get the two on Afra, so there's something to pair with that. All right, Andrew takes the shield, so he doesn't have anything with which to stop the shot. So there's a discard, takes Andrew's Ancient. So we have the two indirect on the trader, Andrew claims, which lets Mike go to work. So two indirect, one on the shield on Price, and one on Kylo. Now somebody's going to take four. Yep. 
price now at five, five health remaining. Can we go into the next round? So Andrew's probably in the lead here, but we did just see Mike draw a droid tank. However, he was out of dollar, out of money, so he only has two dollars. Andrew has bind, so he probably has the board state control, but Mike could quickly get down a BT, and that could change. Price rolls in with a special and a blank. Alright, entangle both of them. It's good to get those dice off the board, but that's really going to hamper Mike's engine here. So Andrew pays 1, 2, plus binds for an heirloom on the Kylo. Right, Sienna comes in. Plus 2, plus 2. That can be real good if you can get something to pair with it. Comes Kylo. I'm sure Andrew calls yellow again. Does not roll well. Oop, pulled red. Did not hit. So Kyle has a blank. There is a plus three on the saber, and there's a disrupt and a shield on the heirloom. But it is Mike's action. Now he's not used. So if he if he has a reprogram in hand, he could potentially drop BT. Uh, looks like that's a Relentless Pursuit there on top, but he just pitched that to re-roll. He wants some money. That's what he wants. So he gets a gun on Sienna and a money on Sienna. That's a pretty good roll. Okay, Andrew pitches a re-roll. He gets a two for one and a two on Kylo. So he has something to pair with that plus three. That'll put Sienna down, unless Mike can remove... He can't, so he's going to take the dollar, lose Sienna. So he lost that gun. Okay, here comes a trader with one indirect, not too big of a threat. And your pitches to reroll, loses a pitches a doubt, and hits hard. Wow. So Kylo on the two, heirloom on the two. Right, Mike has no controls, we already saw, rolls in Afra. four more into Afra. and I'm sure he'll take the two shield on Afra. She does, Andrew claims, here comes triple zero with a one. So this will let Mike go into the next round with three dollars, which will be enough to play his droid tank. So Andrew takes the indirect on Kylo. And triple zero's melee goes into Price, who's now at six. And unless Mike is going to play anything, he should be able to drop that droid tank. On the next turn, of course. Mike is thinking it over. He could put BT down here. if it, We haven't been able to see his hand. Likely BT would have come down earlier if he could have. Right, he backups. Probably blew one and more into Price here. Yep. So Price is with three health remaining. Hilo has ten health remaining. I think Andrew's in control here, but this is not over yet. Alright, Andrew opens with price again. Uh, two melee and a dollar. Interestingly enough, Andrew hasn't uh, claimed to use the price ability yet. He's been able to clear all of his dice without it. 
trader comes in with a dollar, forces the activation. Kylo will come in, gets a two melee, a two melee on the heirloom, a money, and a disrupt. Andrew calls, yep, he calls, he calls and hits yellow. So Afra loses her two shields. Now it is Mike's action again, even though Andrew was forced to do that, um, or because Andrew was forced to use his action to do that as per the trader. Back up for one more into price. Now Andrew can hit melee here. I think he's looking for a relentless pursuits to make sure that Afra is okay. Um, but both of those are already in Mike's discard pile. Okay, so Afra gets overkilled. So just to be clear, Andrew was concerned that with Relentless Pursuit, Mike could move the two damage from Kylo. Oh, I apologize. That is what he was concerned about. So that was actually a bad announcing on my part. Andrew was, that's what he was looking for. He had sniffed it out that Mike probably had that, and that's why he chose to resolve when he did. So, all right, pitches a reroll, gets a one on each. Mike is in trouble here now. Fully healthy Kylo with the Ancient versus a single trader and triple zero. Triple zero comes in with a one melee. Two more into the trader. Trader has five health remaining. Mike takes a dollar. Afra's off the table, so that droid tank can't come in. For minus one, I mean. Right? Four solution for free with binds. One into Kylo. Andrew will claim, most likely. Make bubble shield. Nope, Mike got rid of the droid tank. Makes sense. It's going to be real hard for him to get it in play. He does have $4, but he's going to have to use removal. All right, I'm not sure exactly what card Andrew is looking for there. All right, he's going to roll in, call yellow again, I'm sure. All right, does hit melee on the both sabers. Gets yellow, two more into the trader. Three health remaining on the trader. Andrew is showing two one melees out there. Does not have anything with a special on which to flip. Okay, trader comes in with a two indirect. Andrew doubts it for a one indirect. It is Mike's action. Make that mistake on doubt all the time. All right, one more into Kylo. It's move, so cannot take the force illusion. Two more into the trader. Trader is one health remaining. All right, triple zero comes in with a one dollar. Pitch to reroll. There's a melee. Can Mike do anything about it? He doesn't sit. Doing everything he can to stay alive here. All right, pitch to reroll. There's a two for one. Andrew has plenty to pay for it. Mike got it. Yep, he's laying it down. He's out of options. So, game goes to Andrew. Uh, well done, gentlemen. We'll be back shortly with round four. Thank you for watching.